Welcome back to the FPL Watchlist, where we take a look at three players who impressed over the weekend and will be options to transfer into the FPL Tips team over the coming game weeks. After missing four game weeks with a hamstring injury, Danny Ings returned to the starting lineup for Southampton's 3 2 win over Arsenal at the weekend, where he netted twice from three efforts on target. The 26 year old has been directly involved in four goals across his last four league appearances taking 11 goal attempts and finding the target with 7 during that period. Despite making just 12 appearances this season, his total of 28 shots inside the box is on par with Aubameyang, only Wilson, Jimenez, Kane, Mitrovic and Aguero have taken more amongst forwards. Game Week 17 saw Southampton win their first home game under new manager Ralf Hasenhutl, scoring 3 goals in a single game for the first time this season. They face Man City and Chelsea over the next four matches, but the fixtures in the longer term look promising. West Ham, Everton, Crystal Palace, Cardiff and Fulham travel to St Mary's in five of the next six home games, amongst away trips to Huddersfield, Leicester and Burnley. Despite facing the current champions away from home in Game Week 17, Lucas Digne increased his FPL appeal by registering his third attacking return of the season, providing the assist for Calvert-Lewin's constellation goal. The left-back created two big chances during the match, with Richarlison firing over the bar from Dine's cross in the first half, and only Robertson and Wijnaldum provided more attempted assists at the weekend. Since game week 4, when he first broke into the Everton side, the 25-year-old's tally of 33 attempted assists ranks top amongst defenders, with second place Doherty creating 14 fewer chances. During the same period, no defender has created more big chances than Dine, while only Maguire and Doherty have fired more than his five efforts on target. Everton have conceded seven times over the last six game weeks. Only Chelsea, Man City, Spurs, Leicester and Liverpool have shipped fewer goals in that time, while only five teams have allowed opponents fewer shots on target. The Blues enjoy a favourable run of fixtures after their game week 18 meeting with Spurs, taking on Leicester, Bournemouth and Wolves in the three home matches that follow. Leroy Sané earned his fifth consecutive league start in the absence of Mendy, providing two assists during the 3-1 win over Everton. Two big chances created by the winger in game week 18 was on par with Lucas Digne, no player provided more than the pair. Over the last five game weeks, no midfielder has provided more than Sané's seven FPL goal involvements, and only Son and Richarlison have taken more than his 10 shots inside the box. Similarly, seven efforts on target by the 22 year old in that time ranks joint second amongst midfielders, level with Salah, and just behind Hyung Min Son's tally of nine. When compared with Raheem Sterling over this period, Sané has taken more goal attempts, from inside the box and on target, provided almost twice the amount of attempted assists, and matched his teammate for goals and big chances. Man City face only Liverpool from the top six during the next seven league matches, and have averaged 3.5 goals per game against non-top six sides this season, scoring 42 goals in 12 matches. 